Fly family, anti-fly family. It's late. Had a good, <clears throat> very anti-fly type of uh, day. Uh, took care of some business. Had a good workout. You know, just had a very anti-fly uh, field day. You know, I was being productive, uh, you know, networking, uh, making decisions that was anti that were anti-fly. Like today was a very <clears throat> Hold on, let me uh, anti slob a seat belt. Put my seat belt on. Right, well, that's anti slob, right? Okay. Yeah, I made a very important decision today that was, uh, you know, something that has been hovering over me for uh, at least a year, a year and like three months. So it was good to. Uh, you know, just be real, optimistic about the situation to uh, really just not use any type of emotion in the, uh, just in the whole situation, just like no emotion, just using logic and just setting the emotion aside and really just being critical and just making the best decision uh, as, as, as possible for, for the situation at hand. Just, you know, just being a leader, you know, um, that as a man, you know, that is, that is like a key uh, role, job, uh, purpose of a man is to be a leader. So, uh, yeah, just me exhibiting that quality and making that leadership decision and by making a decision, being a leader. And uh, like I said, using the uh, logic critical thinking, uh, not emotion to make the decision. Uh, I think it really just showed um, like a trans, like a, a, a transition out of the slob, slobbish ways. That is, that is a, that was a, a, a clean, pure definition of anti-slob, uh, what I, what I did today. That's why, you know, I'm coming to you guys and letting you know that I had a very uh, successful anti slob field uh, day today. You know, um, I'm proud of myself. Um, I say it was like I didn't, you know, collect a bag, even though I did make some money, you know, uh, some payday. But it was like not like anything like that. Like this was like a growth bag that I checked. You know, it wasn't monetary, but uh, you know, these are the moments and. Uh, uh, a person, man, boy, uh, especially us, because like I said, we are natural leaders by uh, being men. Um, that it, uh, it was a defining moment for me. It was, it was something that I that I can cherish, that I that add value, that adds value to myself. So I, I, I you know, want to make acknowledgement to it and uh, speak upon it, and uh, you know, make sure that I show uh, use it. You know, to show my gratitude by using it in the right way, and uh, you know, continuing to make uh, good decisions that's going to impact my family, myself, my surroundings, you know, the world in a, in a, in a, in a positive way. You know, that's what it's all about. So yeah, anti-slob. I had an anti-slob day, a defining anti-slob day, and it, it is very important. Because this anti-slob thing is just getting started. The anti-slob movement is, you know, is like brand new. Like the baby was just born. So I just, you know, I find it very uh, powerful and impactful for me to have an anti-slob defining moment right at the inception stage of the anti-slob movement. So it really is an affirmation, a confirmation, a manifestation of my thought to become things and to, uh, you know, really put what I'm saying to practice, you know, like I say, this is an important decision, you know, saying not to put my business out there, but this is like, you know, I was in the office and, you know, this is like a business, like a, a business deal. So it was definitely like a big decision that I had to make. Um, an anti-slob mindset really uh, helped me to make a, uh, like I said, a non-emotional logic, critical thinking decision uh, fairly quickly. Uh, I went over my options. I asked a lot of questions. Um, you know, I, I, I definitely did my due diligence. I didn't just go along, get along. You know, I really 
took the time out to get <clears throat> all of my uh, options waived and explained to me to where I could explain it to someone who uh, didn't know what was going on. You know, I, I basically you know, just literally said, you know, can you explain that to me like I'm a four-year-old? You know, I don't know. I'm not familiar with that jargon, so I don't I have no idea what you're talking about. So, thank you. So, yeah, man, anti-slob, man. I had a great anti-slob day. Um, you know, it's a stamp. i never forget this. Like I said, it's just the beginning. Like, so I, I know something is being done right. So, this is, like I say, an affirmation, confirmation, and a manifestation of the words and the, the mindset of, you know, being reality. And I'm appreciative of this. And I'm going to use this moment to create this momentum and we're gonna do it together. You know, you're gonna see me transform from a slob to a God. And don't take that literal and oh man, you're saying he's a guy. I mean, come on now, stop it with the jokes. You know, you know what I mean by that. When I say God, I'm saying in a God like nature, a God like state, um, pure, you know, uh, someone who has good moral character, you know, striving for the best. You know, no one's perfect, but you know, like I said, anti slob. You're doing the right things and uh, the enrichment things, self-improvement things when nobody is looking. That's when the anti-slob um, mindset really comes into play. When you are doing these anti-slob um, uh, movements and uh, uh, actions when no one is looking, no one is looking, no one is around, but you are moving with a purpose with a plan and it's anti-slob. You're not throwing food out of the window when no one's looking. You're taking it to the trash and you're throwing it into the proper receptacle. Um, you're not, uh, 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 you know, pissing outside, you know, in, in, in the bushes when you can kindly just go in the bathroom and use it. You know, you uh, uh, you holding the door open for the elderly. You know, you, uh, you, you know, good moral character, just doing the right thing when nobody is looking or you don't have to get any type of recognition for this. You know, you, you did something right and righteous when nobody was looking, nobody expected it. Nothing was to be gained from you doing this. It's just you, the air, and you know, the universe, and you did the right thing. You know, make, make it feel good about yourself. You made the bed up, you live by yourself. No one's gonna know you made that bed, that's for you. Uh, you going to the gym. Uh, you're not going to the gym to get girls. You're not going to the gym to get a guy. You're going to the gym for yourself. So when you get done making your bed and you look in the mirror, you're happy with yourself. You like the way you look. You're healthy. You're looking good. You're feeling good. You got a clean house. Let's get it. Anti-slob. I'm, I'm going to stop there. Anti-slob. You hear it?